Leo, hi. So this is going to be a reading for November 2nd through the 8th. And I'll um, take a look into your recent past, your current energies, and your immediate future. And then I'll close it off with a couple of cards from the ooh, universe for you. And these are general readings, so they may not resonate for all of you. If they do, there is an extended at the end of the video. You can check it out in the description box below if you want. Now let's see Leo. Leo, Leo, Leo. All right, so the overall energy for the reading, the Eight of Cups, this talks about emotional detachment here. Uh, let me see, in the recent past, you get the Seven of Pentacles, the Moon, and the Six of Swords. So somebody was walking out the door while they were thinking they still wanted to work on a situation. But they were like, well, I'm out. In their mind, in their soul, they were like, I would still like this though. I don't know who that was, maybe you, maybe another person. Um, in the current situation, you get the world, the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles. So freaking interesting. There's, um, remember that emotional detachment that I talked about? I feel like it's happening possibly on both sides at this time but then how it comes in in the future it's like eh, wrong you know kind of like yeah you 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 tell yourselves that you keep on telling yourselves that that this is done that whatever i'm done with this person no i'm done with you no i'm done no please let me be done you know kind of thing um there's definitely a cycle ending in between the two of you, but not the connection. Because in the immediate future, you get the Five of Swords, the King of Wands, the um, masculine for the Queen of Wands, the Emperor, which comes in as the masculine for the Queen of Pentacles. Very interesting energies here showing up. So the two of you thinking that you remember when we said to each other that it's all done? That's all crap here. Self-deception. Um, interesting. Let, let, let's clarify. I'm really curious how that's going to turn out. Um, yeah, let's do the Eight of Cups. Eight of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. This is a... Um, how do I put this? Because it's not... I feel like this is your person, to be honest with you. I feel like what happened here was that this person has experienced a, a loss in their material world. It's like their job isn't going as well, or their finances aren't looking that bright, or something's happening that's taking a lot from this person's self-worth. And for, because of that aspect, they're unwilling to open themselves up emotionally, not only towards you, but towards everybody, everything in their life. It's like this person is so consumed by what's happening, what's eating at them in their general vicinity that they're like, emotions, love? No, I don't have time for that. You know, there's something else stealing their focus here, which might be pressing, might be taking them down a little here. Uh, eating a lot at their self-worth, pretty much. Uh, of course, this could be you. Roles can be reversed, so I'm just getting that as their energy more than yours. Uh, let's see the moon there in the recent past. Page of Wands, the Devil, the Two of Cups, secretly desiring to be with one another. And I feel like that applied to the both of you. 
neither of you kind of opened up to be like, hey, you know what? I just want to be with you. There's secrecy all over this thing, which made things very complicated, very possibly even toxic between the two of you, possibly led to a place where the two of you saw each other as you lie or something like that, you know? Because there is a sense of why not be honest about things? If you're feeling this way, why not express it? Lots of secret, uh, lots of secrecy around this aspect of I really want to be with you. And that actually might have messed things up. Uh, let me clarify that Six of Swords there in the recent past. Oops. Four of Swords, the Judgment card, and the Knight of Swords. So many freaking swords, huh? Yeah, it's like somebody came to the conclusion that the only logical thing to do would be to walk away from a situation. Which, you know what? I agree. Instead of just sitting there and living with this secret and lie towards yourself first and then towards the other person that you want to be with somebody and you're not really expressing that. Yeah, moving on seems like the right decision here. And somebody thought so too, one of you at least, if not the both of you. Kind of like, I'm just going to give this up. Okay. Doesn't make sense to me, but under the circumstances, I agree. You know? Let me clarify the world. The, the, what doesn't make sense to me is the fact that you would feel something so intense and not express it, but that's just me. Um, clarifying the world. King of Pentacles, the world, and the Four of Cups. This is more your person than you, I feel like. Um, no, it's you. It's you and your person is in between the two world cards, which is like, we're done. And just so you know, and so that I can clarify this better, in case you, you miss that, we're done kind of thing. There's that sense of having to mm, really reinforce it. But again, um, it comes in with the sense of disappointment, a sense of even though we're done, I'm not satisfied about whatever this was in our lives kind of thing. You know, I'm really, really disappointed in you, in this connection, in whatever happened here between the two of us. So it isn't just, you know, lesson learned, I'm moving away, I'm moving on. It, it doesn't come in just with that. It comes in with lots of disappointment. Could be them. I don't know. Seeing you there. Um, let me do the Queen of Wands in the current energies. Six of Pentacles, the Justice card, and the Ace of Swords. Somebody definitely, definitely wants to make things right. Somebody wants to fix this situation while the other person is in that energy of nope. No crossing through this wall here because it's all done. One of you is, you're at two very different extremes. One of you is done, the other one wants to fix it. Let me clarify the Queen of Pentacles for the current situation. Ten of Pentacles, Six of Swords, Wheel of Fortune. Whoever took the decision here in the past to leave, they're not sticking to it. That energy is changing. It's like they're realizing they left something stable, something good, something trustworthy. They're coming back. Hmm. Let me clarify the uh, Five of Swords in the immediate future. Wow. The Emperor, the Ace of Cups, and the Page of Cups. Now, this Emperor shows up twice in your future. That's a very powerful energy of this person coming in. Coming in, not only coming in, but coming in with love. And the expectation of something brand new happening between the two of you. Um, something very loving. It's beautiful energy. You don't trust it. It shows up here as being deceptive. 
on your side of the fence, kind of like, yeah, they're showing up here exactly how, how I wanted them, exactly how I wanted for things to be from the beginning. They're coming with that energy, but I don't believe them, you know? So let me clarify the King of Wands in the immediate future. Of course, again, remember, roles can be reversed. For the Fool, uh, for the King of Wands, you get the Fool, the Seven of Cups, and the Three of Cups. Reconciliation here, showing up. The energy of reconciliation, the energy of wanting to spend a lot of time here with somebody you love is coming in. Uh, the energy of, I really, really want to take a chance here. I would... <laughs> This could be your response, Leo, in the end, even though there's lack of trust there. Uh, could be your response to it, because it's attached to the King of Wands, and that's you. Um, it's beautiful energy, that's all I can say. Whether or not you're trusted, that's a different kind of issue. Uh, whether or not you want to work on that, you know, reestablishing the trust... That's a, a different spectrum here, but the energy is pure. The energy is that of love. Let me clarify the emperor in the immediate future. Page of Pentacles, the chariot, the three of pentacles. Interesting how this energy of the emperor, emperor is showing up. It's like they're learning because their energy coming towards you feels very, very fast. Let's just put it that way. Very rushed. That's how they feel. They want to come towards you. They're not doing that. They're coming in with this page of pentacles. Kind of like they learned from the past or something. Where they, they're like, I'm containing what I feel. Because I don't want to scare my Leo away. So I want to move things slow. And it's coming in with a sense of partnership. A sense of friendship. Which is actually awesome. They're not coming in knocking at your door. And being like, Leo, will you marry me? No. They're coming in with this. Because they might know that you may not trust them at this time so that trust needs to be rebuilt needs to be worked on and this is the way to do it it's like this person knows the the emotions that the two of you feel okay that's clear you feel that towards one another however if you want to experience those emotions trust needs to be rebuilt here and this person knows this in the way that they're approaching you. Um, interesting reading. What can I say? Let's see what the universe has. Four of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, Two of Cups. Definitely mutual love here. Definitely the both of you want for this to happen. For the two of you to come together. Neither of you have ever let this go. Again, the emotions are here. The love, I don't doubt that the two of you love each other. Now, how you can make that work, how you can bring it together and create that bond again of love and experience it through the more practical manners of let's see if we can actually if something terrible happened in the past between the two of you there may be lack of trust and that needs to be rebuilt and they know how to do this you seem to be interested in this aspect that they're bringing and then the love is still there definitely so the practical way of approaching this might be through um something other than love at first you know, until those emotions can be explored again. So that's what I have for you, Leo. Hope this helped and I'll see you next time.